In the last 30 days, my clothing brand made $29,707. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you the exact steps I took to get these kind of results. So make sure you watch this video to the end so you don't miss anything important. And without further ado, let's get straight into it. I created my clothing brand when I was around 13 or 14 years old and called it Seven Figures. What does Seven Figures mean? Seven Figures is basically another way of saying that you're a millionaire or want to become one. So I created this clothing brand for entrepreneurs and all the hustlers worldwide. And to start off on how I was able to make over $29,000 in the last 30 days, I first off had to come up with a million dollar design. My million dollar design was a quote that represents my brand mission, which is all about becoming rich, being successful in multiple areas of life that says, is the goal is to be rich not look rich and i noticed when i made this design i started wearing it out uh it didn't matter if i was just running to the grocery store uh going to the gas station actually going out with friends and family and things like that people always stop me and ask me where did i get this shirt from is this my brand where could they buy it so i knew i had a winning design and with that design i was able to come up with unlimited colorways i even had one of my friends wear my shirt in the ball is life video so if you ever play basketball you already know what the ball is life is that video alone ended up generating me a lot of sales just from uh, his clip alone for marketing i'm using about six different strategies right now to make sales for my clothing brand number one being brand ambassadors using brand ambassadors or adding a brand ambassador program is literally the number one strategy i use to blow up my clothing brand i was able to grow a huge email lists of supporters as well as go viral on TikTok a bunch of times. And the reason this works so well is because influencers get paid to promote your brand. So anybody that supports your brand and can get paid for it is just naturally going to 10x your sales for your brand. And the most important part about this strategy is that you actually own this. So if you built up a huge SMS list or email list of brand ambassadors, people who support your brand, you actually own these um, assets to where if you lost your TikTok account, if you lost your Instagram, you lost your Facebook, you still got a list of people that you can go and promote to and your business wouldn't just be shattered overnight if something uh, drastic happened. Next marketing strategy I like to use is Instagram. Now, Instagram is pretty much a showcase for my brand. So I like to use clean pictures, either from influencers or me putting matching shoes to go with my shirts. My main thing with posting on Instagram, if it's not shareable content, like somebody that go uh, send it to a friend or family or repost it on their story. I tend not to even post it at all. And the easy marketing strategy that I do on Instagram that's 100% free is to go to brands similar to mine. I like to go to their tag section to see who is uh, tagging them in their post. And I like to go and engage with their post. So I leave a like, I go comment. And if they come back in and do the same thing with my brand, they go follow me, uh, leave a comment. Uh, like the post, I DM them a custom discount code if they show love. And I actually generate a lot of sales just doing that. Next strategy I use is influencers. And what I would do is I shoot them a DM saying, hey, my brand represents uh, striving towards success. And I'd love to send you out a free shirt. They respond say, yeah, you can do that. Um, they send me the address, uh, what colors they like, things like that. Now, some influencers would charge to take pictures. Some people, uh, especially like micro influencers, they'd be happy to just get some merch, take some pictures for you. You can post it on your page. And I do this for social proof because if people come to my page and they see a bunch of high quality uh, pictures and popular people inside of my niche uh, to make it easier to sell to them rather than having a bunch of mock-ups on my page looking like a typical uh, TikTok or Instagram brand. Fourth marketing strategy I use is email marketing. And email marketing makes up about 70% of my sales because I built it uh, using a brand ambassador program for my clothing brand and with my email marketing I'm able to do weekly drops so even when I'm not posting on Instagram I'm not posting on TikTok I can easily just write up an email and literally print money at the click of a button next strategy I use is TikTok marketing and with TikTok I mainly just promote my brand ambassador program as well as recreate viral videos that I see other clothing brands do and recreating the viral videos is how I was able to get I think my first three to five thousand followers and after that I kind of just took off with the brand ambassador strategy and if you're doing TikTok I highly recommend downloading this Chrome extension called sort for TikTok is free and it basically sorts any TikTok page viral videos from top to bottom. So when I'm going to other clothing brands, seeing what's working for them, I like to just use the app at the click of a button. I can see their most viral content, recreate it to my brand and just start uploading. Now with TikTok, you want to stay consistent because without consistency and just posting and trying out different things, you won't know what worked for your brand and staying consistent and finding something that works. All you got to do is double down on it and you will reach pretty much any goal you can imagine. Next strategy I like to use is utilizing trends. So with trends, I like to incorporate these with my clothing brand. So it don't even have to be clothing brand related. So I had a video that blew up one of my sweatsuit sales all because I seen like this trend of like date nights with the uh, index cards, things like that. I went and had me and my friend go and put on the sweatsuits and created a whole video similar to everybody else's and ended up generating majority of the sales I got for that sweatsuit in that colorway. So whenever you're seeing people post on Instagram or TikTok, something that's going viral, whether it's clothing brand related or not, find a way you can include your clothing brand in these videos and you'll be sure to see some 
some success at some point. Now, another tip slash marketing strategy that you could do is offer pre-made plus same day shipping. This actually helps me generate sales uh, with new people 10 times easier than doing the pre-order method because most brands, if not, I want to say almost 90% of brands on TikTok or Instagram is only doing the pre-order method. And let me tell you, nobody want to wait weeks or months to get their orders because what they don't tell you about the pre-orders is crazy customer support you got to deal with, chargebacks, disputes, merchant accounts being closed and things like that. So I like to offer pre-made items, especially for new customers. Now you might ask, how would I know if my design is going to sell before I go and get stuff pre-made, which is why I said earlier in the video, I like to wear my stuff out in person. And if people compliment me on it, I know I got a validated design. And from there, I can start with a small batch of orders, even if it's only 10 shirts, 25 shirts, it really doesn't matter. You already got the validation in real life and you can start from there. Another thing that helped blow up my clothing brand is repeat customers. Repeat customers make up 30 to 35% of my revenue, which is why I love having a design that I can replicate over and over and over again without having to drop completely new pieces every single time. I got one design I could just change the colorway to and drop every day if I wanted to, every week, every month. I could do it really consistently and it makes me reach my goals 10 times easier. Another thing I recommend everybody that's watching this video go and do is run giveaways, man. Especially when you're starting out your clothing brand, nobody wants to buy from a brand with under a thousand followers. So I recommend to get your first thousand to 3000 followers before you start promoting your brand. Just so people, when they come in contact with your page, they trust you a little more rather than a page with only a hundred followers, 200 followers, and they start thinking you a scam. So what giveaways do is grow your followers extremely fast, as well as you getting sales on the back end of doing giveaways, which is a great head start for anybody that's starting a clothing brand. Another golden marketing tip is competitive analysis. What this means is studying your favorite brands or brands that got the results that you want. So watch their stories, watch how often they post, buy their products, they'll see the type of emails they sending out, the text messages, the packaging, the whole customer experience. You want to go to a tag section to see, to find new influencers for your brand or even potential customers. And with studying your favorite brands, you will come up with almost unlimited content ideas just from watching them. And also another golden tip, if you're running ads, you can go to any of your favorite brands, Facebook pages, and go see the exact ads that they running on Instagram as well as on Facebook. All you gotta do is go to a Facebook page and click on the tab that says page transparency. It'll bring up all the ads that they're running currently. And you can use that as an idea for your next ad that you run. Another thing you can do is give people incentives to place an order with your brand. That could be offering a free keychain for the first X amount of orders, free shipping on orders over X amount of dollars. So it could be $50, 75, 100, et cetera, et cetera. Or even a buy one, get one free offer. Just things like that to get people to wanna make a purchase. Now, if you need a list of manufacturers, graphic designers, tutorials, resources, and more, highly recommend you go check out my website bamdcb.com i'm gonna leave a link in the description as well as the comment section down below also if you was interested in my brand ambassador strategy i got my building a million dollar clothing brand course dropping july 28th so depending on the time you're watching this video the course will be live that course is gonna go into full detail a to z step-by-step -step training videos going over my brand ambassador strategy sms email marketing influencers facebook ads everything you name it and if you're interested in that like i said everything will be in the description or in the comment section down below if you got some value out of this video make sure you subscribe to my channel turn on post notifications so you'll be notified when i drop my next video follow me on instagram at big jalen i'll see y'all in the next video